I was member for sin. Dame Josephine Abaija was born in 1944. She comes from Misima in the Milimbe province. Her belief in the central province people was what elevated her into the political sphere. She founded the Papua Besina movement. She believed that Papua should have been given independence. This black and white photo shows a young Abaija lowering the national flag and replacing it with her own party's flag. I believe in what I was fighting for at that time. And I still feel that unless they correct that, we are going to have problem all the time. I really believe that because I see the signs and everything that's happening here. I mean, you can, we can say, but we are, we are not standing up as, uh, as uh, people in other places. When they want something, they stand up and they, they get what they want. What she wants is for Papuans to make a bold stand and speak up for their rights. When asked if she sees the type of leadership she stood for in current leaders, she could not point out any, but instead attributed traits in the late Sir William Skate. You must be able to stand even if they're pointing a gun at you, that type of leadership we need here. Mm -hmm. you are, and that's how the people will see that uh, this is the leader that we need. And mm -hmm. So I, I hope that there, there are some men, I'm talking about mm -hmm. men, I'm a woman, mm -hmm. they are men. Mm -hmm. I want them to come out. Uh, mm -hmm. Or are they going to lead us all the way, uh, like how we are going? Mm -hmm. I'm challenging the Papuan men. She is happy with the current women in parliament. She sees them as strong, capable women, but advises them to always remember to take heed of what their people want, never to act high and mighty. She stood for four terms in parliament, the first in 1972, the 1977, and then 1982, and finally, in 1997. For I had a very hard time in Parliament when, when, I, when mm -hmm. I got in. Because it was not the norm, uh, I, therefore I had a hard time. Uh, I, I said to myself, OK, I'll just do what I have to do, go and make my speech and just run away. And that's what I've been doing. A full interview will be telecasted tomorrow at 7 p.m. on MTV's Talk Pixar program. Meredith Kusa, National. MTV News.